Hi there, welcome back to the official Oraha Foundation YouTube channel. Now before we get started, make sure you hit that subscribe button for more content that will help you get a healthy smile. Now today is World Oral Health Day, a day that aims to remind us of the importance of taking care of our oral health and the positive impact that can have on the rest of our body. So we're going to break down our top oral health tips into a nice easy short guide and after you watch it, you'll be well on your way to good oral health. Let's get down to business. Now you can break down the essential components of a good oral health routine into five parts. One, brushing. This is something that you will have no doubt heard many, many times over the years and needs little to no explanation, but here it goes. Brush your teeth. Use a fluoride toothpaste for two minutes, twice a day. Do it once at last thing at night and one other time during the day. Number two, interdental brushing. This essentially means cleaning the tight spaces between your teeth. It's important to remember that your toothbrush, while effective, can't clean every single nook and cranny where bacteria can hide and grow. So to address this, we need to use interdental brushes or floss, whichever one you prefer, at least once a day. And in the process, you'll keep gum disease at bay. Number three, spit don't rinse. Now this is something that you might not have heard so much, but it's still very important. Make sure after you brush your teeth, you can spit out the excess toothpaste, but don't rinse. Leave the fluoride on your teeth and it will work its magic throughout the day. Number four, develop a healthy diet. It goes without saying, right? If you develop a healthy diet, it's much better for your oral health and general health. So stay away from sugar as much as you can. Also, try to avoid snacking. If you have three meals a day, rather than snacking from morning till evening, it's much better for your teeth and your gums. And last but not least, number five, visit your dentist, and I'm sure you knew it was coming. But seriously, it's so important to visit your dentist for a number of different reasons, and not just when you've got a problem. They're fantastic for giving you advice on a range of different treatments and assessing your suitability for them. Dental hygienists and therapists can offer you great advice and it will help you prevent oral health problems from occurring at all. And with every trip to your dentist, they should be giving you a mouth cancer check. So, a trip could really save your life. So there you have it. It really takes a relatively small amount of time to give your oral health the attention it needs. So act on mouth health and you'll reap more benefits than just a healthy smile. That's all from me today. Thank you so much for watching. If you found it useful, give us a like and don't forget to subscribe for more videos from the Oral Health Foundation.